Hey guys, Jabali here. I am in Chicago right now for Frosty Faustin's tournament. However, I took a break with my buddy Puna right now to come check out Galloping Ghost Arcade. I'm not sure if you've heard of this place, but if you live in Chicago, I know you have if you're a gamer. Uh, but this place is basically arcade heaven and a museum of over 550 plus arcade cabinets. They have some sick prototypes here. Uh, it's pretty amazing. So right now, here's just one corner. I'm gonna pretty much walk through this whole place for you. Right now, the great, awesome pro player literally doing is play all the Mortal Kombat's and Killer Instinct. It's basically like a one of the very machine. Primal Rage, and then one of the only original arcade cabs in existence for Primal Rage 2. I believe this is like a prototype. Uh, got some shooters here, cave shooter here. The lock, there's the front desk. They recognize me, so awesome. But we still pay because we want to support places like this. <laughs> uh, invasion, abductors right here. Uh, some stuff I've heard. Now this, time travel. These are Sega Coliseum machines. I actually remember these as a kid when I used to go to the arcades with my brother. Uh, I'm just like, I, I mean like right now I see it, but it's like I cannot, uh, what you call it? I wasn't able to see over the counter when I would play this as a kid, but right now you see me just picking characters. It's a nice little holographic fighting game. This place is awesome, man. So, yeah, right here, and then it's just basically a beat em up fighter. Uh, go through, going into another room now. Like, this is just insane. Like, just a whole row of pretty much every game you remember as a kid. Another room. So, it's a little tight, pretty packed in here. You gotta walk through, but that's how they fit everything in here. Kung Fu Master Classic. Oh my god, these are just everything you can imagine from an arcade standpoint. Uh, there's another corner on back to. Oh my god, they have a full standing Silent Hill arcade shooting game. So, Silent Hill right there. All the pinball machines. Space Harrier, what a classic. Wrestle War, love me some wrestling games. Hopefully, they have Wrestle Fest if this is here. Uh, yeah, and then you know, you go back over to this. <laughs> this is just one room. This place is like. I, I, before I came in, I expect it to be like super duper huge. But now that I'm here, I'm like, okay, now this is how they fit everything in here. So I'm gonna go into the next room, even bigger. Star Wars Trilogy Arcade, back in the day. This is insane, man. I'm trying to walk through everything for you. Saturday Night Slam Masters, another wrestling classic. Man, where's WrestleFest? They have to have WrestleFest. So. <laughs> Mage, Dark Four, uh, I'm sorry, Dark Age. Hey, sorry. Uh, oh, God, it's enough to remember all these classics, man. Just everywhere you go. Pit Fighter. This is most of money into that place. It's actually. Just fight, like, still walking through this place. <laughs> Super Monkey Ball, like they, they pride themselves. The owner, I believe, just loves to collect. Revolution X used to play this, all the little secret areas you could shoot to go into secret places. Lethal Enforcers, Simpsons, used to hear that sound effect all the time. You can imagine how crazy this place gets when it's really, really packed. Um, wow. Biohazard, the Japanese name for Resident Evil. Dungeons and Dragons, I mean, Jesus, this place is just crazy. Commando, Contra, Super Contra, Jackal, Rainbow. So and like, the cool thing about this is they have like high scores everywhere. So you can check out this stuff. Uh, yeah, Call of Thunder, Robocop. I was still got Neo Geo machines with all the different games you can select within them. Uh, Baseball Stars is actually one of my favorite arcade games to play a lot of. So Double Dragon, Samurai Showdown, Gauntlet. I mean look, I'm in the like still. Insane guys, this place is just ginormous. Okay, Jam, what? Still more to go, another room. Arch Rivals basketball. Batman. Sorry. Yeah, it's a little takeover. I mean, this place gets crowded. It must be really uh, cumbersome to get around places. Wow, Metal Gear Arcade doesn't look like it's connected, but actually here it is. Wow, there's a Metal Gear arcade machine I didn't even know existed. So this is awesome. You sit down, wow, you sit down with it. <laughs> right there. And by the way, so to play here, 20 bucks, all you can play. Everything's already set to free play, so. Which is a steal to support an amazing place like this. But, yep, got a tech right now, fix some stuff. And they take very, I can already tell everything's very well taken care of. So, virtual fighter here. 
lot cooler for open ice NHL. That was a cool game. <laughs> the black bars because the refresh rate can keep up with the phone. So yeah, I think I pretty much got to this place, but just incredible. If you're ever here, man, in Chicago, definitely put this on your place to visit. So um, yeah. Now I'm gonna play some games for a couple hours, then head back to Frosty's. So take care.